What's going to happen in the next six months? Anthea, tell us. I don't think it's going to go to six months. I think this is going to get sorted out before then because we are obviously a laughing stock now. Yeah. My instinct would be, let's take a toys and go and play another game. It's far too embarrassing. We need to go. Mm. But that's not practical. But she's so not going to let that happen anyway. And she is she's not, not going to let that in. happen. No, she's not. So I would like to see, personally, I am a Remainer. Very happy to say that. I listened to Mark Carney because I thought he spoke the most sense. Well, every time he opens his mouth, um, the pound, the pound drops. Or Peter, Peter, he, 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 told us, he warned us, he warned us of all of this. We all knew what was going think, to happen. No one listened. We if did. you look at he Betty Boothroyd, spoke more sense yes. than anyone. Michael Heseltine, Betty Boothroyd's yeah. speech, a good working yes. class northern lass. She told it how it is. Yeah. She's got no pressure from constituents. Tell She's what just, how it is. No one knows. This is just Betty Boothroyd or Michael Heseltine have no idea what is going to happen. Yes, so I don't want to go on fantasy and belief. I want to go on fact. You want so to go on I fact? Want to you go want to on stay in a failing trade block. It's they, not failing. We've had... I'm, we've sorry, been, I'm sorry, it is failing. It's, it's growth over the last five years has been 0.3%. Ours is more than that as a single country. As a block, we've they are failing. We've not done badly Can, can I just ask it? another one then? Um, um, in the uh, in beginning of June, I think that it's going to coincide with D-Day actually, Donald Trump's coming over for a state yeah. visit apparently. <laughs> and he is, he is already briefing that he is coming with massive trade deals to offer Britain. And and, he, and he's been very outspoken about the EU. He hates the uh, European Union. Um, he wants to do deals with us. Is that something that maybe we should now embrace? Yes. But is he just polishing no, it? Yeah, no, like they always, always trust there. Trump. If, a, if two countries want to deal with each other, if companies, we're actually talking about companies now, want to deal with a company in America, they're going to deal with them. You know, and they're going yeah. to carve out a deal, and with or without our situation with Europe. You know, Tr we are. Trump's policy is, and since he became president, his policy <clears> is, you know, it's what's best. It's his, his policy is America first. And that's mm. all Britain wanted yeah. to do mm. in leaving the EU. And that was a good intention, but it first. hasn't worked. It doesn't well, work. Well, you said it hasn't worked. Solution. Well, all right, so we have to have a deal. We've got six months more of this. Yes. Oh, <laughs>